Hey guys, Greg here, Bone Tactical, and today we are going to talk about some of my newest products for 2021 and the transition into 2022. Some of these are prototype products here, and because we do so much prototype testing with our warriors overseas and with our, you know, OCONUS groups that we work with and the, and the security teams and all that kind of stuff. So those are the guys that are going to be using this some of the, the prototyping the gear, and then I'm gonna be offering it when I'm 100% sure that it's the most effective edged weapons, self-defense tools, and non-permissive environment gear in the world, then I will release it to the public. In this case, we're starting to branch into just getting into some beautiful stuff. We've got the ability to work with wood now, and we're doing a great job working with wood. Uh, I've been working with wood for years and just finally kind of getting good at it and, and really having the opportunity to, to get out into the, into the jungles of, of Central America with my expedition vehicles and find fallen trees, especially after the hurricane. There's been fallen trees everywhere, so we're picking up a, we're doing a big run of the bone occlusion bracelets, which now we're doing in black. Everybody's been asking so specifically for black and kind of one of the things that I'm really most excited about now that we're discussing wood, aside from the incredibly beautiful Cocobolo wood that we're working with, is the new cedar ashtray, okay, cigar ashtray, very high-end luxury item. And in, in particular, this ashtray, I'll show it to you here in a second in, in greater detail, is really something that is just unparalleled of quality it's we have the ability to since i'm making my own products i can make it however i want to make it right i can i don't have to meet a deadline of making a certain amount of products i don't have to make anybody else a certain amount of money okay i i don't have to have a certain profit margin i can make the best product no matter what it costs and that's what i did with these and they really just are absolutely incredible, these ashtrays. They're just handmade, beautiful. And I started way before anybody else that's making these kind of ashtrays, they start with some kind of a budget-friendly wood, a wood they can afford to work with. Well, there's different kinds, there's different types of cedar wood, and this particular cedar wood is the best, okay? There's different grades and classes, and this is very, it's a little harder than what you'll find in some other countries. This is a Honduran cedar that's just absolutely beautiful. And it's, I only take it from very large, very old fallen trees. So it's just, it's a quality of cedar that's unparalleled. That being said, let me go ahead and just demonstrate this ashtray to you. Because a lot of times a picture or video in this case is worth a thousand words. I can talk all day long about how beautiful this ashtray is, but if I'm gonna show it to you, then you guys will understand. There's no paint on here, guys. There's no varnish. This is, an, I put a little bit of uh, boiled linseed oil on here, and that's it. It's just the wood and beauty, okay? It smells amazing, it looks amazing. It's just beautiful, beautiful cedar. And, and we, this logo that you see on there, the Bone Tactical logo is burnt into it, all right? Burnt into it, I heat it up in a fire, uh, a bronze branding iron that I have, and I put it in there and I burn it into it. So 
That's what we got, guys. This is what's going on. This is the ashtray here. And it's just amazing. It's a solid block of some of the best exotic hardwood in the world. Going from there, we really have stepped into fully running our new colorway. You guys may have seen the new colorway that's demonstrated here on the Bonehawk. This particular tomahawk is the Bone Breacher, the world's strongest and sharpest tomahawk. Our Bone Tactical Proprietary colorway you can see here, we have Bone Tactical Proprietary color buckle, Bone Tactical Proprietary color cord and matching sheath. All right, we're the only ones using, this is my color. I'm the only one using it. There's nobody else who's got the, this color Kydex, nobody else who's got this color buckle, nobody else who's got this color paracord. I'm the only one. It's bone tactical colorway and, and this is it. It's beautiful, obviously. You guys can see how amazing this is here. And the, our, our tomahawks have just reached a level where I can't keep them in stock because they're just so far ahead of any competition. They're just absolutely unbelievable. The workmanship, the attention to detail, the quality, they're just beautiful, beautiful, beautiful pieces. And, 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 and our knives now, our tomahawks have been there and our knives are now there as well. I've always had the most effective blades. Now I'm starting to get into blades that are collector's quality pieces that are that are just pure beautiful works of art these these wooden handles that we have on the the, the coca bolo they're just unbelievable the the other handles on the modern warrior edition okay are made from our coffee bags from bone tactical coffee company the 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 ones that you can see here the ones that you have seen there that's bone tactical coffee company on the modern warrior editions and then the additions that we've got here on our, what we call our Resolute Warrior Editions, this is Coca Bolo. And it's a, it's a type of Coca Bolo that's nearly extinct. There's grades of, you can say Coca Bolo tree, but there's grades of Coca Bolo. And this, I found one massive tree, fallen old tree. And when this is gone, it's gone. I'm not going to be able to find anymore. I can be that honest with you. It's this type of coca bolo wood, so desirable and so sought after that it was thought to be extinct not too many years ago. The hurricane blew around some trees. I actually lost the fallen tree that I had been using before, and you guys can see the video here on the channel. We went and found the we went and, and found the wood. We couldn't even get to the farm that this fallen tree, we had moved the fallen tree to a farm and we couldn't even find the farm because it was so far off into the wilderness. Bridges had been washed out. Honduras was destroyed by the, the hurricanes that hit recently for those of you guys that didn't know. So that's, uh, it, Honduras is a country where, where they, were, they really went, the people really went through some, some pretty heavy difficulties. So you guys also, I'm sure are aware that we're doing a lot of stuff to help out in the, in the country and, and do what we can for the people in need. So we've been, we've been doing that along hand in hand with trying to grow the business a little bit. Another new product that I've got is the new version of the money belt. Okay. Our new version of the money belt is this is the low vis version, low visibility. It has no logo on the front at all whatsoever. Just incredibly high quality, the highest quality you can get, basically calfskin leather, grade A leather, top grade leather, okay? And then we've got the Bone Tactical webbing where you can actually read Bone Tactical in the webbing itself. So the, the webbing now says Bone Tactical on it. You guys can see that there where the webbing says Bone Tactical. So you can read Bone Tactical right there on the webbing and that's it's black on black. The only change is the, is the style and direction of the color. They're, they used to be up to like 36, I think, size 36. These are one size fits pretty much everybody. If you're a 44 inch waist, you can probably still wear one of these. I'll do the exact specifications. I don't even have these listed on the website at the time of making this. 
I had prototyped them for a long time. I've now got a bunch of them made and, and finally finished them up. And then I'm going to, I've been so busy. I'm going to get them up on the website for you guys though. Now for you bigger guys, they're ready to go. You don't have to do anything extra. And for you smaller guys, all you have to do is cut a piece off and then burn it with a lighter where you cut it. You don't even have to burn it with a lighter, but I just like to, it's like when you do paracord, I like to seal it a little bit. So, so it has that aesthetic look to it. But so they're pretty much one, fi one size fits everybody now. We, we, we were really able to find a really cool way to get that done. The Traveler's Money Belt, you guys know, is like a deep cover thing that allows people to carry, you know, hidden valuables, stash spot. It can pass pat downs, all that kind of stuff. So that's, that's the idea behind those. We've got the, the bone breakers, the solid steel. Stainless, solid stainless steel bone breakers. Those are, are really going strong. They're a very, very popular item. We've still got these. These are gonna be going into 2022 as well. Just finished up a bunch of them with a new, just a new attention to detail, a new level of detail. Uh, the stone wash finished is now, this is an older version here. The stone wash finish is now even more beautiful than this one. Inside and out, we go over every part with various levels of sandpaper and, and hand files, and they're just absolute. They've always been cr incredibly functional. Now they just basically look better. So we're, we're doing all this stuff at the end of the day for you guys. My original goal was, again, the most effective edged weapon, self-defense tools, and non-permissive environment gear in the world. That goal's been smashed, accomplished, destroyed. We're industry leaders, and we have been now. It's 2020. Uh, we have been since 2019, it's 2021 right now, and we are way past that. And now we're getting into some of the most beautiful, all already the most effective, already reliable. Now some of the most beautiful weapons in the world. You guys have seen our lineup of leather sheaths. Okay, we've got a full lineup of leather sheaths for most of our products. I'm going to be continuing in development until we have a leather sheath for every product, until every edged weapon, every tomahawk, every knife has a leather sheath, I'm not gonna rest. So I'm working on that. Know that I'm working on that. We've got our new clip system, which is, it just clips right into the waistband here. You can just clip right however you want to into the waistband, gym shorts, anything like that, it'll work. It's the same clip system now for our ADC Kank and our Karambit. You can use this clip system for any of the knives. You guys know the EDC Kank. The EDC Kank will probably be sold out at the time of making this video just because I think there might be one left right now. I'm actually way out here in, in, in a very deserted area right now uh, on our, one of our training grounds. We're doing some, been doing some training weapons, testing, looking at weapons to, to equip our teams and stuff and, and uh, just kind of like testing some of the weapons that we have out here. You guys might notice that there's some other other weapons that I don't make that are on this table right now, and uh, this old this is an old uh, old relic that I you guys happen to know that I'm into the old Colt Commandos and stuff like that. I just happen to like that stuff, so it doesn't have to be new school to me. Iron sights, uh, if I know how to use them, if you know how to use iron sights, then then you're good to go with iron sights. It's it's the old adage of you know fixed blade verse verse folding knife, a fixed blade's always gonna be faster, it's always gonna be more reliable. But yeah, we're out here kind of running and gunning, doing some, you know, evaluating some stuff that we're possibly gonna be equipping our guys with, doing some training, training some other people, training some new people, doing some testing of some guys that wanna work with us, stuff like that. Weapons testing of, you know, knives, tomahawks, edge weapons, karambits, all that stuff here at our facility. And, uh, and hanging out, you know, hanging out, doing some, doing some, doing some hanging out for sure is always a, always a good to, to get out and, and, and leave the cell phone behind. So out here where there's no signal, where there's no internet, where there's no, like, actually there's no electricity here where I'm at right now. So it's just, it's nice to, uh, yeah, I could, I could, I could put electricity and I could run, put in poles and run power lines and all that stuff, but it's, uh, it's nice to be able to get away and that's kind of what I do out here and I take this time to film for you guys. So please give me some feedback so I can keep these videos coming because if you guys like these videos and you like this kind of stuff, then I need to know what you like. I need to know that this is what you want to see more of or the other thing is what you want to, or you don't like it because I won't take this time. I'll, I'll enjoy my cigar by myself, you know, 
and, and do other things and do my training and, and manage my, my international business in other ways if this isn't helping anybody. Because again, you guys know my goal is always to help others in the ways that I can. And this is the stuff that I know and this is stuff that I'm good at and that's how I'm helping. So let me know please what you wanna see more of if you like this video, if you don't, so I can cater to you guys and so I can cater to helping you. I really appreciate you guys tuning in. I feel like we've got a great thing going here. I, I do appreciate it. And that's why I take the time to do this, to lug out around all this, all this camera equipment and try and improve every time. And I'm learning the game with camera equipment. So comment below, let me know specifically what videos are your favorite. Tell me, Bone, this is my favorite video. Give me the title. This is what I wanna see more of. Thank you, da 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 da. This is a video I don't like. This is why I don't like it. And I'll, I'll cater the stuff to you guys. I'm, I'm at your service for your, you followers out there. You specifically, thank you. Thanks for watching. Bone out.